Hey, Scorpios, let's get into your messages at this time. All right, messages for Scorpios. Messages for Scorpios. You're powerful all by yourself, Scorpio. Okay. Why is this message coming out for Scorpios? You're powerful all by yourself. Look at what wants to come out. Status and success. Scorpio, some of you may have gotten yourself to some sort of... Um, okay, so status and success is on the way. Scorpio, there's some sort of status and success that's on the way, but you did this all by yourself, okay? You climbed up the ladder all by yourself. You didn't ask for help. You didn't do anything shady to get yourself to the top. No, you did this out of sheer willpower, okay? Your vibe is extremely attractive, Scorpio, so... Um, this goes back to like that reading that I did um, prior to this where it says your aura is gold. Your aura is golden. So you could be um, vibing very high right now. So you are definitely attracting a lot of people towards you. It's giving me like Empress energy. Jack of all trades, the master of none. So Scorpio, you could be very diverse in um, what you do. Maybe you do. Maybe you juggle multiple things, right? Maybe you could be an entrepreneur for some of you. It's like you have learned a lot of different trades here, Scorpio. You know how to do a lot of different things. Maybe you haven't mastered one particular thing, but you can go anywhere and be like, yeah, I got something for that. Or I know how to do that. I know how to like you are very diverse. You can go anywhere and find a job. Okay. And you don't even have to have a degree or a master's. Like, you can just go somewhere and get the fucking job done, Scorpio. And they can't touch you. So, you have energies here that can't touch you right now. What else for Scorpios? A higher source is helping you reach your dreams. Wow. So, you're very connected to the divine right now. Your angels... Um, pay attention to your dreams because they they are guiding you. They are helping you at this time to reach this status of success that um you're headed towards, and it is on the way. All right, what else here for Scorpio? You're meant for great things in this lifetime. Wow, this is beautiful. And rebuilding and healing is wanting to come out. So a lot a lot of you could um have had to rebuild yourself, have had to heal and rebuild yourselves your whole life. Okay. Yeah, look at this. Unexpected wealth right here, Scorpio. So you could be coming into some sort of unexpected wealth. Breaking free. And look at that. Right under this. Key to finances. Doors of financial opportunities are opening up. Wow, Scorpio. Okay. What else? Teamwork makes the dream work. So you could be um clicking up with someone here, teaming up with somebody. Um, okay, so somebody could be coming in. Giving you some sort of financial support. Or you could be getting financial support from like different sources. Could be coming in from a masculine energy here. Or you could be a masculine energy. Yeah, you're about to have fresh new beginnings here, Scorpio. After some sort of abuse that you've endured. What else here? Look at this. You cannot make this shit up. A stroke of financial luck. Good luck sur um, surrounding money. And then what is owed to you is going to be repaid, Scorpio. Wow. What else? So spiritual court is here. So there's it's judgment time right now for somebody. So if somebody was trying to um, take from you, Scorpio, again, you're about to get what is owed to you here. This could be some sort of financial support, child support. Um, something that somebody owes you here. It could be alimony, whatever. There could be a masculine that's un that's under judgment right now. It's like somebody, I feel like somebody was trying to stop your greatness, Scorpio. One more. Favored in all realms. Scorpio, this is why things are working out in your favor. Especially when it comes to your status, your success, your finances. Somebody could have really been trying to hold it back here or, or take from you. August could be significant. You could be dealing with a Leo or a Virgo or the month of August is just significant. So Scorpio, tell me who this king is. 
Some of you could be reaching like this king status, this boss status, okay? Tell me about king here. Five of swords. So somebody could be bitter and jealous because you're... Um, mm. For some of you, there could be a masculine that's like winning in court. Even if this is spiritual court against the feminine energy here and like they're winning. <laughs> For some of you, there's a masculine here. Whoever this king is, I feel like this could be um, the Wheel of Fortune. Somebody who's bitter because things aren't going in your favor, Scorpio. Bitter because you got yourself to this king or queen status by yourself. So this could be, if you're a masculine, this could be another masculine. If you're a feminine, this is a masculine energy. Heavy, heavy male energy. But somebody's bitter because things are going in your favor here, Scorpio. A king of swords, Aquarius, Super Gemini at the bottom. This could be somebody you've walked away from. This is not an air sign. This is somebody you've cut off um, or set some firm boundaries with, Scorpio. This is somebody who... Could have tried to mentally manipulate you here. This person's very smart with how they say things, Scorpio. Or how they manipulate situations. Tell me more about King here. Five of Pentacles. So somebody could be going through a financial loss here. So for some of you, this King here could be somebody you have children with. All right, this could be somebody who maybe did, was not paying child support, was leaving you with you and your child with nothing or just leaving you with nothing, okay? Even if you don't share children with this person, but there is some sort of financial support coming in. I also feel like there could be a masculine who's going through some sort of karma here. They could have gone through a major loss in finances. They could be going through a major change in their life, but this is some sort of bad karma they're going through. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, masculine energy at the bottom. Libra energy here, justice. Yeah, somebody could be going through a divorce. They could be going through some sort of court battle here. But this is somebody's fucking karma, Scorpio. Excuse my language, sorry. <laughs> but this is somebody's karma. They, somebody was trying to cheat you out of money in some sort of way. And now they're going to have to pay up. I don't feel like this is just spiritual. I feel like this is actual, like, literal court. Somebody is going through some sort of legal battle. Somebody could be trying to come towards you asking you for some sort of financial support, Scorpio, because they have gone through some sort of financial loss. They could have lost out on a lot of money because they have to pay child support. They could have dealt with somebody who was very spiteful and bitter. But somebody's coming towards you because they're definitely in lack on a financial level um, when it comes to their resources. This person is just feeling like defeated in life, Scorpio. So somebody could be trying to come in for your help, okay? And I feel like spirit is wanting you to stay in control of your emotions, okay? Because you are a loving and kind person and you do feel for people. It is important to keep your emotions in control like the King of Cups would. The King of Cups has mastered their emotions, mastered how to keep their emotions in control. No matter how much they love somebody, it doesn't mean that they're going to bend at their will, right tell me more about give me one more for this king six of swords this could be somebody you um yeah i feel like somebody could definitely be traveling to you scorpio or they're needing money to travel or get away from a particular situation here ace of swords at the bottom um they could be coming towards you with some sort of truth as well about what is going on in their life. But again, what they're experiencing is karma. So if this person's coming to tell you some sort of truth, Scorpio, this is their karma for whatever it is that they did to you. Okay. And you're, this is going to like, this person coming to you is going to be your confirmation on that. Um, so let's see what else is going on here for a Scorpio. Why is spiritual court here? The chariot and the five of pen. I'm sorry, the five of uh, wands. So this could be over this five of pentacles energy spiritual court here. So I feel like there's some sort of ongoing spiritual battle here as well. 
somebody could have been trying to cause some sort of drama or chaos in your life, Scorpio. And now there's some sort of judgment being cast over this person in a spiritual sense because you're favored in all realms. Somebody could have been trying to definitely definitely cause chaos on a spiritual level like they could this could have even been some sort of chaos magic but you were being protected for the, from this or something like that scorpio because you are favored in all realms somebody was trying to fuck with you or stir up some drama here somebody was trying to distract you with drama while you were like while you're focused on your goals scorpio you are over here having tunnel vision Somebody tried to like stop you dead in your tracks, stop you on your path and try to distract you with some sort of drama here or putting you in a position where you may have had to fight again, just heavy spiritual warfare here that somebody or a group of people could have been trying to create. What is the spiritual core? Cancer energy here. Page of Pentacles. You could be receiving some sort of news, but I, um. This, I feel like this is some sort of news, but I feel like this is, okay. So you may be getting some, okay, so let's say you're having dreams or downloads or intuitively picking up that there's some sort of judgment happening on somebody, right? I feel like you may be feeling this on a spiritual level, on an intuitive level. You could even be seeing things in your dreams that somebody's getting their karma, somebody's getting their ass whooped okay in the spiritual realm right now or somebody got their ass whooped by you and now they're getting their ass whooped by your guides something like that and possibly by their own guides for trying to mess with you here especially when it comes to your finances and where you're supposed to be in life when it comes to your status and success like so some of you are like you're meant to be somebody very big or you're meant to do something that you're meant to be very very successful okay you're meant to be on a stage or a platform or something here so i do feel like um you may be receiving like messages about this on an intuitive and spiritual level but you're going to receive again some sort of news in the physical realm about what is going on or the karma that this person is receiving scorpio from the spiritual into the physical And I feel like this is something you already have, like some inner knowing or inner knowledge or some sort of um, deeper knowledge about Scorpio. One more for spiritual court. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here as well. Yeah, eight of somebody is going to spiritual jail. Eight of swords. Page of wands. This is going to be communicated to you in some sort of way, either by your spirit guides not i feel like your spirit guides are going to give you this message in some sort of way spiritually and then you're going to receive it in the physical realm this person is this person is going to spiritual jail and their spiritual jail is them going they're going to have nothing in the physical realm they're going to have nothing they're going to be defeated in some sort of way scorpio they could be left carless jobless homeless now, i don't wish that on nobody but this is literally somebody's karma for trying to do it to you wow Somebody could have no transportation here. Somebody could be trying to move towards you, like maybe trying to come live with you for a little while, Scorpio. Somebody may need a place to stay. Again, somebody needs some sort of financial support here now from you, Scorpio. After maybe not giving you the financial support, after leaving you out in the cold with nothing, now somebody's going to need you. The tables are turning. Wheel of Fortune. The wheel always turns what is teamwork makes the dream work queen of swords okay aquarius libra gemini what is this what is teamwork makes the dream work Nine of swords. So it's like somebody is, there could be something you said, Scorpio, to someone that could be like making them stay up at night. Ten of swords. Somebody realizes that they fucked up, that they 
they betrayed you, Scorpio. They backstabbed you here. Somebody's realizing, like, if if they teamwork makes the dream work, somebody realized, Scorpio, that if only they had worked with you, they would be in they would be going up this ladder with you or, you know, something like that. You were willing to have this person on your team. You were willing to build something with this person. Whether this is a family, a friend, a lover. Okay, this could have, again, for some of you, this is somebody you did share or do share children with. Or share a child or children with, okay? And now, Ace of Pentacles, you may have a huge blessing coming towards you, Scorpio. And this person is completely burdened in their life. But I do feel, tell me more about teamwork makes the dream work. I do feel like there is Queen of Swords, I mean, King of Swords, Queen of Swords and King of Swords. Yeah, there's definitely, I feel like a pair here. You're going to be coming together with somebody who's just as intuitive and intelligent as you, Scorpio. Somebody who is just as knowledgeable and um, serious about what it is that you want and what you do, Scorpio. I feel like you and this person are definitely a vibrational match, whether this is, I don't know, I feel like this is more like, you know, business oriented, but you and this person are very laser focused, very serious. Um, I feel like you are two independent, very independent people, very powerful by yourselves. And it's like combining your brain power together to make something huge. Scorpio is what this feels like. Yes, you are powerful all by yourself, Scorpio. This is something that you complete. You realize. I feel like you've you've set boundaries. You've cut a lot of people off, especially this particular person who you wanted to take to the top with you, Scorpio. But this person did you dirty in some sort of way, and now they're going through some sort of karma, and you're gonna be finding this out. Okay, somebody's definitely in spiritual jail. So, yeah, I feel like you and somebody else are on, like, the same page, on the same wavelength. It's like you guys communicate. You guys speak the same language. Now you're talking my language. Now you're talking my language. <laughs> Anyways, um, <laughs> is that Drake? Anything else that Scorpio needs to know here? Justice. Justice is being restored. Balance is, is uh, coming in. And karma is here. And somebody could... Be, somebody's definitely going to spiritual jail. Somebody's about to almost... Like, they're going to lose everything, Scorpio. If they haven't already. Because they were trying to take this from you. Or manipulate you out of this dis distract you stop you cause chaos and drama on your path if this person did something illegal with scorpio this person is definitely going to jail but for most of you this is definitely this person's going to spiritual jail look at this the high priestess and the hierophant for somebody some for some of you this is definitely some this is a somebody you were meant to work with on a spiritual level scorpio and here we have um justice spiritual court this is a judge this is also like a judge like the gavel is being hit scorpio the gavel is being hit on somebody that was supposed to be like a spiritual counterpart to you Pisces, Taurus energy, Libra, Cancer, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Scorpio, Aries at the bottom, more Scorpio with judgment. Judgment is being called on somebody. This is divine judgment. Somebody's whole foundation is about to come crumbling down if it hasn't already, Scorpio. 
because they tried to do this to you. Again, the same message I keep getting. The tables are turning. The shit that people were trying to do to you is going to be happening to them. Lord have mercy. Wow, Scorpio. Let's see what this status and success is for Scorpio. What is this for Scorpio? We have author. You have a book inside of you that wishes to be expressed. Make the time to write it. So some of you here could be authors. You could have written your own book or you're in the process of writing your own book. Um, some of you may not even want to work with someone. Some of you may just have your boundaries completely up. And again, you have free will. But I do feel like somebody wants to come in and work with you here. Um, some of you could, you know, write a book and then go around speaking about it. Um, but there's definitely like something about books, writing your, you know, your life story here. talk to your angels instead of worrying ask for divine guidance so there's like nothing that you need to be worried about at this time scorpio i feel like right now you just need to meditate and connect with your angels for any sort of divine guidance but i feel like you're on the right track right now you're on the right path you're on the good side of karma and beautiful amazing good things are about to come your way especially on a financial level like your dreams are about to come true. St status and success is on the way, Scorpio. And just know that, yeah, you did this by yourself. Somebody tried to sabotage you here. Um, and that just did not work. All right. Some of you have like your your life is like a book, Scorpio. You could you could write a, a book on your life. OK, that shit is like <laughs> I'm hearing it's like a it's like a it is a nonfiction book. Right. But what's that called? A documentary or something. But. Your story is probably so unbelievable, Scorpio, that it could just sound like a fairy tale. Like, not even a fairy tale. Like, a, a fiction novel. That's what I want to say. There we go. <laughs> All right. Look, writing at the bottom. So some of you are really destined to write here. Whether it's books, poetry, music. All right. You're meant to do something when it comes to um, writing, expressing your thoughts, your feelings. You're very... Um, guided and protected to do this like this is very much your mission your angels are all around you when you are like you this is when you channel the most scorpio whenever you're writing okay some of you channel heavily when it is when you're writing all right that is beautiful some of you could be strong manifestors through um writing like uh scripting here as well very beautiful let's get some advice all right, advice here for Scorpios. Advice here for Scorpios. <laughs> Golden Palace. All right, let's see. Number 23, you could be born on the 23rd. Um, You could be 23 years old. You breaks down to five. You could also be born on the fifth. It would be a life path five. Um, Or the number 23 is just significant. So let's see, there is always enough. The Golden Palace card represents good fortune, ambitions fulfilled, wealth, and prosperity. It may also indicate emotional fulfillment, as perhaps you're entering a time of happiness that's long overdue. The message here is that self-worth isn't measured by what you have, no matter how abundant your life is. Instead, it comes from what you are, how authentically you're living your life, and how much love you're willing to share. Granted, receiving this card does indicate material gain and a furthering of tangible rewards, but things come and go, and knowing your true value leads to even greater riches now. Share the wealth. Scorpio. Beautiful, beautiful reading. Um, <laughs> like, comment, subscribe, and share if this resonated. If you need anything, um, everything is in the description box below. Uh, until next time, guys. Bye.